This video of the 1948 Indianapolis 500 was derived from a 16 millimeter silent movie film taken by my father, Mario Levetto Sr. This historical film is not an account of the actual race, but a document that transmit the conditions of the average spectator and the general atmosphere of the speedway in those years. As you can see, the video is representative of an average grandstand spectator with no privileged viewpoint. Notice the dress of the spectators, the small crowds if compared to current years, the grandstands, and the pits and the methods used to prepare the cars for the race. The pre-race celebrations. The 1948 race was won by Maury Rose in the number three Blue Crown Spark Plug Special, which was a date offy. Second was his teammate Bill Holland, car number two. Third place was Duke Nayland in the number 54 Novi Grooved Piston Curtis FD Novi. Of the 33 cars, 20 were powered by Alfie engines. This compared with the previous year where only 13 were Alfie engines. There were three Maserati engines, one Novi, one Alfa Romeo, one Mercedes, one Miller, and six others. Seven cars completed the 200 laps. Five were powered by Alfie engines, one Novi, third place, and one Maserati, the fourth place finisher with Ted Horn. Ted Horn was national champion in 1946, 1947, and 1948. He died in October 1948 as a result of a racing accident. He was 38 years old. Here the cars start the parade lap. As I said, seven cars completed the 200 laps. The eighth car completed 198 laps and was the number 33 Alfa Romeo driven by Johnny Mauro. Twelve cars were running at the finish. Notice the pits. Spectators leaving their seats to get a bit closer to the racetrack. Number four, Charles Van Acker with his South Bend Stevens Offie.